Now, today I'm going to be speaking to the Queen of Morbid that is Adele, and if you don't know who she is, then you're either in a happy relationship or you are on tranquilizers. So, hello Adele, I'm glad you managed to pull yourself together in order to speak to me. Hello. How are you doing today? It's me. Yes, I know that because the interview was pre-arranged. I've forgotten how to hold a conversation normally. Okay, I did not realise that the entire interview was going to be conducted using your lyrics. I can already feel the black fog rolling in. Could have had it all rolling in the deep. Oh, Jesus Christ. Go ahead and sell me out and I lay your shit down. Adele, I need you to focus and listen to me. What would you say to the rumours that fans aren't as impressed with your latest work? Do, 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 do. Rumour has it. Rumour has it. Rumour has it. Christ, let's move on. Okay, can you tell me whatever happened to the guy that you wrote all these songs about? I set fire to his face, watched it burn cause I'm on that case. Then he fell and he died and I remember how I like to mime. I quite frankly don't know where to go with this so I'm just going to wrap this up. What would you do if you weren't famous? For a day, eat a grape or two. Take a taxi down to the brew. No part time work just wouldn't do. Just to feed my dog. Thank you, that was both horrific and insightful as to why hormonal women and impressionable teenagers should not buy any of your music.